November 30th, 10.43, bright sunny day, innocent people. Truck approaches from the west entrance. Mate, mate, you can't park here! 10.45. No time to do anything about it. This is the most high-profile murder case in British history. You and Ms. Howe are defending the accused terrorist from the government. And you're from the New York Times. I don't speak to journalists about trials relating to matters of national security. Do you know of any reason which would prejudice your ability to carry out this case? No, my lord. No, my lord, I know of no reason. There is some evidence against you which the prosecution believes should be kept secret from the public and from you broke into my chambers. I think you're mistaken. Claudia, we're being managed. Within six months, our client goes from driving a taxi to driving a brand new Mercedes, spending two grand a week. Where did all the money come from? The British intelligence brought him in as a double agent. He was supposed to lead them to the terrorist cell before the attack. And that's where it all went wrong. Prior to the bombing, there was no contact between MI5 and the defendant. Defense lawyers who ask the wrong sorts of questions, they're expendable. There are over half a million closed circuit cameras in London. I'm sure there are at least half a dozen watching me right now. There are people who really want a conviction here. Should have kept her mouth shut. MI5 do not kill people on the mainland. But what the hell have you got yourself into? We're simply trying to defend our client. Dump your bag, dump everything. Get out of there, now. There are powers at play that neither you nor I may even hope to control.